So we have your formal title, but when somebody asks you what you do, what is your typical answer? So I have a lot of things within my scope at the organization. So I manage a couple different accounting groups. So our closing and consolidations globally, as well as our RPA uh, development team. Um, and I also work directly under the CFO for any special projects. How many years of experience do you have in automation? We started automation back in 2018. And before then, I had no experience, um, so I picked it up. I'm an accountant by trade, so I had no experience with any sort of development or anything and was able to uh, pick it up and, and work with a team to uh, launch the program. What would you say is your biggest achievement to date? I would say within our RPA team, the biggest achievement has just been the, the amount of uh, automation processes that we've put into production. We're well over 100 at this point. Um, over the past four years, we've really scaled up from simple solutions for reporting to transactional RPAs. Um, we've really covered a lot with, with our solution. So we have you know, different personas in automation teams, typically leaders, developers, and business analysts. Um, where would you say are your biggest strengths and what is an area you would like to develop? I think the biggest strengths that we have is on our management team as well as our development team. They are able to take new cases, find new cases, and develop them pretty quickly and, and get them to production and really get the value out of it. And I would say places that we could improve upon would be finding new use cases. That's always been one of our biggest challenges, going out and really promoting it and finding new ideas to bring in you know, more use cases. We have a, a pretty good backlog, but I, I would want to get more from all of the global teams. What product areas are you most eager to learn more about? No, I think for us, the intelligent document processing is one area that we could really focus on and get a lot of value out of. What are you most excited about in the MVP program? I'm excited just to meet everyone, network, hear what everyone else is doing, and, and try to learn more about the RPA space. Have you mentored or coached others in your field? And what is your greatest piece of advice? So yeah, I've uh, been able to mentor others within within our, our team. And you know, I would say the greatest piece of advice is just be open for innovation, open for change. Um, always be learning and trying to you know, push the boundaries of, of what's possible um, because you'll find out a lot of times that it is very possible to, uh, to make things better. Great. What are you focused on professionally as your next steps? Right now, professionally, I'm, I'm really focused on working with our leadership team and uh, the, the chief of staff role that I'm in now is you know, having a lot of exposure to our leadership and just understanding what they're focused on and, and making sure I'm able to bring it all together. Cool. Okay, we are now to what I call our fast five okay. personal questions to get to know you a little bit more. If you could have any superpower, what would it be? Teleportation. Cool. Go anywhere. Yeah. When is your birthday? In May. What is your favorite movie? Step Brothers. Step Brothers. Yes. Cool. Uh, what's the most adventurous thing you've ever done or would like to do? Surfing. You've, and you've done it. I've done it. Yeah. Yes. I like it. I grew up surfing. Okay, Love surfing. Cool. And if you could travel anywhere in the world, where would you go? Japan. Japan. Great. Tokyo. Well, thank you. So thank great you. to get to know you.